I think we'll take that one. <laughs> okay, Queen of Pentacles in the reverse, and then Knight of Wands in the reverse. So Queen of Pentacles in the reverse is overall an energy of a person that's unstable. They don't work hard. They don't want to work. There's somebody that's like a gold digger. Somebody that, you know, they'll do anything for some money. They don't know how to manage finances. They don't nurture their self or, you know, anybody that's around them. They just don't care. They're just all about getting some money and then the money is gone. There are, could be people that like catfish people, scam people. Out of money. Queen of Pentacles in the reverse and then Knight of Wands in the reverse. So this person could have been a sex worker. Somebody that, you know, used their body to get money. And there, you know, Knight of Wands in the reverse is like, you know, lustful energy. So they, you know, no one wants to, you know... No one wants to do anything with them to give them any money, I would say. So they can't manifest. So whatever they have been doing, you know, in the, in the past to manifest money, as they had the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse, getting quick money, doing anything to get some quick money, having people lust after them, be at the Knight of Wands and doing a lot of stuff without thinking it through, quick to have sex with them, it's not working. Yeah, Page of Cups. Somebody could want to apologize at the Page of Cups. Or this could be somebody that's, you know, emotionally immature. They could have thought that they would, you know, get a whole bunch of money. This person thought they was going to scam somebody for a whole bunch of money and they will place a lust spell on this person and they will have this person just at the night of ones running around doing a lot of stuff without thinking and quick to have sex with them and this person would just be at the page of cups emotionally immature not knowing how to properly express their emotion and it didn't work the night of ones is in a reverse this person don't even want to have sex with them no more whatever lust spell that, or sex match that, that they have in place on this person it did not work. Yeah, the musician. They were sitting back playing with magic to try to get this person, you know, to be attracted to them, to keep this person, you know, giving them money to have sex with them. This was an overall prostitute. And this person is a musician. This person is manifesting, have creativity, foresight, and they got control over their future's path. And this person is just, you know, going down. He a queen of pentacles in the reverse. Knight of wands in the reverse. So they had them, they had them, you know, whatever clientele that they had, they tried to control this person. They had them slip whatever else they had coming in in the reverse. Yeah, this person got a whole ten of pentacles. They, this person thought that they would be attached to this person, ten of pentacles. They would manifest this person, Ten of Pentacles, you know, cast and, you know, sex magic and lust spells on this person, and it did not work. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. They thought they would sit back and they knew this person was a gift from, you know, a gift or something like that, or God wanted, was going to gift this person, Ace of Pentacles. Maybe they thought they were going to take this person's gift. They knew this person would get gifts from God. They knew this person had a Ten of Pentacles. And they thought they would manifest this person. And it did not work. Knight of Wands in the reverse. Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. So whatever money or whatever this person thought they were going to attach themselves to this Ten of Pentacles, it didn't work. They got exposed with the Sun card. Things was illuminated. Secrets had been exposed and revealed. Yeah, that this person is somebody that's the devil, somebody that's toxic and bonded to bad habits, obsessions, addictions, and worse. 
Yeah, they overall put a death to the situation with this death card. They put an end to the situation immediately with this person, this a scam artist. Yeah, they sailed away. They were divinely guided to sail away and move away from this person at the Six of Swords. Because this person has no longer served purpose in their life. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. And this person is sitting back going through equal give and take. Whatever they did came back on them tenfold. They thought they would sit back and manifest this person. They wouldn't be able to use their own free will. They would have them under lust spells and sex magic. And it's just coming back on them. They can't manifest anything but toxicity and being binded to bad habits. Yeah, six of pentacles, equal give and take. Whatever you do, come back on you tenfold, good or bad. Yeah, but this person look at you as somebody that's like they're equal. That's why they cut this person off. Because Empress popped out. As I was thinking to myself, do this person, look at this person as their equal. And then Empress popped out. So yeah, this person look at you as their equal. That's why they sailed away from this person. Because they look at you as their equal. Six of Cups. I mean Six of Pentacles. Six of Swords and Six of Pentacles. So they sailed away to somebody that, you know, they look at as their equal. And then the Empress popped up. Somebody that can embody every queen in the deck in the upright position. Yeah, Five of Cups. And this person sitting back at the Five of Cups. Embarrassed. Because they thought they would use sex to try to keep this person trapped down. And they would be attached to their legacy. They would manifest a whole bunch of money. And it did not work. This person is still a scam artist. This person still is a gold digger and don't got money coming in and would do anything for some quick money. The only difference is they can't get people to have sex with them no more. Knight of Wands in the reverse. Because they thought they were going to use sex to keep a person stuck. Now they can't get nobody to have sex with them or get no money from. And they sit back and regret at the Five of Cups because everything out of the backfired on them. They are ashamed. Embarrassed. Don't even want to face the world. As they literally sat back and thought that sex would get them what they wanted. And they would manifest anything by having sex with people. Placing them under lust spells and love magic. To keep them stuck. To get what they wanted up out of them. Yeah, justice is here in the situation being balanced out. This person had did a lot of stuff. And that's why justice is here. This is their justice for whatever they had done did. Multiple times. This ain't the first person they did this to. They had to be used to doing this. Yeah, this person started being at the four of pentacles, stingy with time, money, and energy. This person had to cut this person off of their energy. And they were trying to hold on to this person. Yeah, they wanted to hold on to this person and thought they would manifest this person's ten of pentacles, a whole bunch of money, this scam artist. And that was the only reason why they were sleeping with this person. Because they were getting money out of this person. And this person stopped sleeping with them. So they couldn't get no money out of this person no more. This person had the four of pentacles. Stingy with time, money, energy. They looked at you as their equal. They put a death to the situation and sailed away from this person. Yeah, two of swords. A lot of people was blinded to the truth. They thought that this person was blinded from the truth. That they had placed a lust spell on them. And was using them for money and would, you know, have sex with them to try to get, get stuff out of them. They thought that this person was blinded from the truth. Two of swords. Yeah, but this person is not blinded from the truth. Ace of wands in the reverse. Yeah, this person ain't blinded from the truth. This person wasn't blinded from the truth. That's why they jumped at the four of pentacles. Being stingy with time, money, and energy moving in silence. Yeah, Tower and Knight of Cups. So this person, you know, they wanted to connect with you and something happened. It's like as soon as they tried to connect with you, something happened that they didn't even see. A tower. 
And this person caused that tower moment, knowing that they wanted to connect with you. Whoever this scam artist is, this queen of pentacles in the reverse that was mad because this person was at the four of pentacles. Stingy with time, money, and energy. As they didn't know that they were being stingy with time, money, and energy to an energy vampire and a reptilian. That were draining them for time, money, and energy. Yeah. They knew this person was trying to take a leap of faith towards you. To speak their emotions. And they created a tower for this person. Something could have happened. Could have been something in the justice system with this justice card popping out. And that this person was blinded from the truth. Yeah, because they knew this person was in love with you, King of Cups. Nine of Pentacles in the Tempers card. Yeah. They, they, this, they knew this person was in love with you. They knew that you were somebody that minds your own business, a single person, somebody that can stand on your own two feet, somebody that's celibate. So you're the total opposite of this person. You balance this person out, this King of Cups, the person that's in love with you. With this Tempers card and Nine of Pentacles. That's how this person looked at you. And this person that's in the reverse, this karmic, they were jealous of that. They were mad because you can stand on your own two feet. You don't have to be a scam artist. You don't have to use people for money. You don't have to have sex with people to get, you know, get what you want or get money from them. And they were jealous of that. They were mad about that. And they created a tower moment so this person couldn't contact you. Or, you know, express the way they feel towards you. Yeah, and this person could have ghosted you at the Five of Pentacles, left you out in the cold. Yeah, Queen of Swords, you spoke the truth to this person about something. You just type person that's, you know, speak the truth and you cut off things that no longer serve you. And you spoke the truth about something to this person. And this person left you out in the cold at the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, you were healing. The star card. You are a healer. This person could have been healing though. Or needed to heal because you had healed. And you were healing. You poured out love to this person. But you also woke this person up spiritually. Yeah, you woke this person up spiritually. They could have... Something could have been revealed in a dream with this nine of swords. Nine of swords is being like at a mental prison in your head. Slander, gossip, sleepless nights. Or, you know, getting exposed for stuff that was done in the dark. So as you were healing, this person was going through a dark night of the soul. Yeah, they were in their head about this. They had to go through this dark night of the soul so they could heal and get woke. Hmm. Yeah, high priestess. You told the truth about something. About this person or this situation. You told the truth about this scam artist. And this person was in their head at a mental prison. And a lot of rumors and lies and gossip was spread on you at the Knight of Swords. This person got mad because you were speaking the truth about them. Yeah, High Priestess and Knight of Swords. You were speaking the truth about this scam artist, this prostitute, and they got mad. Yeah, in the past, Six of Cups. This stuff that took place in the past. Yeah, the lovers, page of pentacles. So they went and got a reading on you and this person. This this person that thought they would use, you know, sex to get what they wanted and be attached to this person's ten of pentacles. They thought they would manifest, use magic to get, you know, your you and your person's ten of pentacles. And they had them went and got a tarot read on both of y'all. They haven't sit back paying for readings on both of y'all, you and your twin. The lovers and page of pentacles. This person is somebody that's very childish and they don't have much to offer. They thought they were creating blockages at the seven of wands for both of y'all. 
That's why they would constantly get readings on both of y'all to create blockages. So y'all wouldn't be able to come towards each other. And they could keep creating towers. But yeah, this uh, something backfired on this person. As the overall energy is that they don't get, you know, nobody even want to have sex with them no more. So they, you know, could have overall got exposed for everything that you haven't told this person. With this high priestess card and nine of swords. So whatever you spoke the truth about, this person got exposed. And they, they sitting back at the nine of swords at a mental prison in their head. As slander, gossip, rumors, and everything that they had to be doing in the dark is getting exposed. They thought they would run around and lie and spread rumors and negative gossip about you and lied on you. All because you spoke the truth. That immediately backfired at the seven of wands. Because you divinely protected. Yeah, the moon is here. It was a lot of stuff that was hidden, a lot of stuff that was secret. As this person didn't know you was a whole high priestess. You knew that this person had secrets. You knew what this person was trying to do to you and your twin. Yeah, this person just wanted to get some quick money at the Knight of Pentacles and thought that they would slow y'all union down. Y'all would never come together. They had control. And they thought they would manifest your Ten of Pentacles, your twins' Ten of Pentacles. And they would slow both of y'all money down. This person had to slow themselves down. Queen of Pentacles in the reverse, Knight of Wands in the reverse. So whatever money that they were getting for, you know, having sex with a person, using these uh, lust spells and trickery spells, and they're not getting nothing out of it. They can't even manifest whatever money that they were getting in the past. Just because they were trying to manifest your, you and your twins, Ten of Pentacles. It backfired. Yeah, and they sitting back at the Three of Swords, heart broke. Depressed. Sitting in depression. That's where they wanted y'all to be at. Heart broke and depressed. Yeah, Ten of Swords. They had them place the Ten of Swords, a curse and a hex on them. As they thought they would backstab y'all and pin y'all down for harsh, painful endings. They had them placed it on their self and they sent back heart broke at the Three of Swords. Because they know they had them placed the Ten of Swords on them. Yeah, and I'm speaking the truth, King of Swords. They knew it when this person spoke the truth to them and cut them off. That they had them placed the Ten of Swords on them. They wanted this person to sit back and be heartbroken, depressed about cutting them off. So they thought they would backstab this person with multiple people. And it backfired on them. They still got exposed. They still sitting up, can't even sleep at night. They sitting back depressed, a mental prison in their head. And can't even make no money the way that they used to. They can't get nobody to come in at the Nine of Wands. And do stuff without thinking it through. Yeah, they're being rejected at the Four of Cups. They wanted y'all to feel rejected. They're being rejected at the Four of Cups. It backfired. Yeah, they're sitting back with, at the Ten of Wands. Feeling burdened, feeling pressure. Feeling like they got a lot of weight on them. A lot of stuff in their face that they didn't see. And a lot of stuff on their back that they cannot weigh. And this is where they wanted y'all to be at. So y'all would never come towards each other. Yeah, the situation being laid to rest. You had to be in isolation and in solitude. Your twin had to be in isolation and in solitude at the Four of Swords. So you can continue to get enlightened. You continue to keep, you know, cleansing yourself, healing yourself. Because your twin was breaking a generational curse. Ending the old cycle out with this person so he could walk into a new cycle. So he had to end, you know, he had to play, you know, bring an overall end to a situation with the four of swords. Lay a situation to rest. As this person sitting back sick, that's probably why they cannot even, you know, manifest nobody to have sex with them. Because they probably got something and they're sick. It backfired immediately. And they got exposed. Whatever they had to ran around her and got, they gave it to people. 
And a lot of people had, you know, probably started gossiping about this person, spreading a whole bunch of, you know, truth behind the scenes. Whole bunch of gossip. Hey, this person that gave me this and that and this and that. Do you know this and that? And everybody just started talking about this person. And this person is sitting back sick at the Four Swords in isolation and in solitude. Everything backfired on this person. Yeah, they're going through judgment, karma. Sitting back going through judgment. And that's the truth, Ace of Swords Clarity. And then Ace of Cups. Yeah, they sitting back going through judgment for, you know, wanting to try to manifest your Ten of Pentacles. You and your twins' Ten of Pentacles. And they thought they would use trickery and sex to try to, you know, keep this person stuck. Keep your person stuck under a spell. And it backfired. This person ended up getting set all the way down where they couldn't even have sex with nobody for no money. They sick. And your twin is at the Ace of Cups taking care of yourself, loving yourself. Overall in love with you. And then Two of Pentacles. They could be sitting back, you know, trying to balance things out, balance something out, a situation that they were in or feeling the need to balance things out with you. Yeah, this, they want to communicate with you. Page of, page of Wands and then King of Pentacles. They want to communicate with you. This is somebody that's overall like a stable person, a nurturer. They work hard. Somebody that's, you know, a business person, a jack of all trades, a business male. Yeah, they want to work with you. Maybe they have been sitting back working on their self. They see you have been working on yourself. And they want to work with you. Eight of Pentacles. They see you somebody, they, you're somebody that's at, you know, at the Six of Wands in high honor in their eyes. They hold you high. Yeah, and they want to move forward in life, or they have moved forward in life, you know, from all of this stuff that they were going through behind the scenes. They're moving on from situations after gaining clarity in the truth. Yeah, this person is an emperor. They had to gain control over their self and this situation. Yeah, they made a decision at the Three of Wands and they know what they want out of life. Seven of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, and Eight of Cups. So yeah, this person was overall stuck in a self-made prison. They were feeling stuck in life. And they didn't know why they were feeling stuck as trickery was being cast over their mind. Manipulation. They were being manipulated around, you know, certain energies and certain situations. And they were feeling stuck, you know, at the Eight of Swords. They could have been stuck in jail in a situation, you know. Going back and forth to jail and they didn't know why. And then Eight of Cups, they walked away at the Eight of Cups from toxic situations. Because they started viewing life differently as they, you know, were stuck. In a self-made prison. In their head. Eight of Swords and Eight of Cups. They walked away and started building on their self. Investing in their self. They could overall want to invest with you on, on something. And then Seven of Swords popped out. Yeah, Three of Pentacles in the reverse. So it was somebody behind the scenes that thought they were smarter than this person. And they were being sneaky, deceptive, lying, sneaking, cheating, stealing, just a dishonest person. And they thought they would use this person for whatever they can get. And they had got caught, three of pentacles in the reverse. They can no longer be sneaky behind the scenes. But this person... This, this person that got sick 
whoever this is, they had got them sick too. And they don't even want to build with them or work with them behind the scenes no more. Three of Pentacles in the reverse. They look at this person as somebody that was at the Seven of Swords sneaky and deceptive with them. As you get what you put out. You thought you were at the Seven of Swords being sneaky with this person. And this person was at the Seven of Swords being sneaky with you. You get what you put out. Yeah, you get what you put out tempo and then it, it, it come in mysterious ways that you were least suspecting you didn't know. So as you have the seven of swords with people that you know you know or you don't know, that seven of swords can come back and somebody that you would least suspect that you know and you, you don't think that this person would do this to you. But that's just how the devil works. As you had them called on that devil to walk in devil energy and not your own. Yeah, the will of fortune is here. That was destined to happen. That was fated to happen because whoever you had them backstab, that person didn't do nothing but show love to you as the lover's card is up here. That's the, that, that's the card that stands out. This person didn't do nothing but show love to you and you jumped at the three of pentacles behind the scenes. Being sneaky and deceptive at the seven of swords and thought you were smarter than this person. You got sick with this person. So you overall knew this person that this prostitute was trying to you know, manifest their Ten of Pentacles. And you thought you were smarter than this person. And you got sick too. Yeah, this was destined to happen. The will of fortune is here. Karma. Yeah, because you were sitting back at the five of ones with this person. Jealous of this person. Trying to copy this person. Trying to one-up this person. Yeah. You were secretly sending drama and conflict to this person. Yeah, Seven of Cups. You thought this person would be confused at the Seven of Cups. You were creating illusions around this person. Wanted this person to think they had a whole bunch of options. And the whole time you had the Five of Wands with this person. You look at this person as somebody that got a whole bunch of options. And you don't have none. Because you run around sick with this scam artist. <laughs> I'm so dead, man. Yeah, Ten of Cups. You want this person's family to be confused is what I'm hearing. Seven of Cups and Ten of Cups. You could have wanted your own family to be confused. You didn't want them to know that you was at the Five of Wands with this person. Trying to help this third party as you a third party individual. Y'all both were trying to help this help each other get manifest this person's Ten of Pentacles. And block them from their twin. By sending conflict secretly. Trying to one up a person. Compete with a person. Yeah, all the hate and jealousy. Envy. Y'all wanted to sabotage this person, defeat this person. Because y'all mentally unstable at the five of swords and jealous. Yeah, y'all wanted this person to be stuck in the hangman position. You could have this person stuck in the situation facing jail time right now. And they didn't even know. You wanted their family to be confused. Whoever this person is, family to be confused. And they would know that you had nothing to do with it or this third party, this prostitute. Yeah, all because you knew this person had the two of cups. And you want this person to be stuck in a hangman position. You thought you would manifest this person's two of cups. It backfired on both of y'all. As this prostitute thought that they would keep him stuck. You thought that you would sit back and manifest this person's two of cups, this person's soulmate. And it did not work. Yeah, eight of wands in the reverse. You didn't want this person to contact this person. You didn't want this person to send this person no text message. You didn't want this person to write this person over the internet or go quick towards this person. Because you sitting back jealous, envious, wanting to sabotage this person, defeat this person at the five of swords. All because you were secretly in competition with this person at the five of wands. And this person that didn't ever show love to you. They family had to show love to you. You had them at the seven of cups confused. You get what you put out, man, tenfold. Yeah, the, a person is a whole hermit. This person had went within to investigate, gain wisdom and knowledge, and they know that you have the five of wands and five of swords with them. Jealous, envious, trying to co copy them, compete with them, one-up them. This is somebody do number show love to you, and you want this person to be stuck. 
Whatever you thought that you were going to have this person stuck and tear this person down, it built this person up. Strength is here. Yeah, this person has already been through a lot. So whatever you thought you were going to throw at this person, it made this person stronger. It gave this person growth. Yeah, four of wands. This person still have a union. This person is still coming in union with their twin. Yeah, the hair fine and queen of wands. Yeah, you wanted, you wanted, you wanted to try to, you knew this person was attracted to their twin and want to be committed to their twin. And you thought you would throw every obstacle in their face to try to have them stuck. And you working behind the scenes with this prostitute that's out of commission, done got sick and got people sick and got you sick. And that's your karma. Because this person didn't do nothing but show love to you. And you got behind the scenes with this person out of hate and jealousy and secretly competing with this, with, with this person that didn't do nothing but show love to you. Yeah, y'all standing at a two of ones not knowing which way to go. Y'all thought this person would be at a two of ones not knowing which way to go. Stalemate. This person can't make no proper decision. They stuck in this situation facing jail time trying to figure out how they gonna get out. This person was called to have patience and y'all didn't know how God worked. The hangman is here. Y'all didn't know. This person was called to have patience to be in a hangman position. And yeah, nine of wands in the reverse. Y'all can no longer do something over and over and over again. Yeah, page of swords in the reverse. Y'all didn't know that y'all were sitting back being watched. Do whatever y'all had done did. You can no longer try to watch a person, try to gather up information, or try to create towers here and create towers there. It don't work. Yeah, this person is still in love with this person. Queen of Cups, this woman is still, this person is still in love with this man. They're still in love with each other. Yeah, three of cups. And these people are reconnecting with each other to celebrate. Yeah, and y'all not going to be happy. Nine of cups in the reverse. You're not going to be happy about that. Yeah, king of wands. Because you want this person to be attracted to you and it did not work. 